You know, I'm just here, just doing my routine, getting my morning coffee as I do usually, you know, just normal routine. Us Gollum just essentially just drops a bomb out of nowhere. I'm just calling out the fact that Resident Evil 1 Remake is uh, essentially just BS at this point. Um, I don't know who to believe at this point, but it feels like we're currently going through like this Resident Evil Evo resident evil information tug of war so i i really don't know what to think anymore i'm just here to provide you guys the information and but anyways enough talking like, let's let's get to it also leave a like on the video and subscribe okay and one more thing guys i do want to mention this because i know a lot of people are expecting re9 to be at like at a showcase or you know the summer game fest of some sort if you guys do not hear anything about a new resident evil title please don't feel bummed out we are all in the same boat together essentially and there's going to be a lot of other great titles that you can enjoy as well in the summer game fest um we still have you know all the silent hill stuff i by the time i upload this video i had already uploaded the silent hill um transmission video um if you essentially do like resident evil you will love the silent hill series as well you know we just have a couple games in the summer game fest and i hope you guys you know just keep yourselves occupied you know you don't have to necessarily feel bummed out just uh play other games while we all wait for you know for any news for re9 or something like that but there you go that's my speech let's let's move on to present lion i guess because this is like his future self speaking but you guys get the point all right peace so right off the bat dust golem just says fuck it uh, i'm just gonna like let this out there and let everyone just know that you know some of this are bs and i'm gonna actually tell you what they're actually working on and then he says i'm choosing to be the one to burst the bubble in the bigger way of what's going on with resident evil stuff first i would wipe the expectations of resident evil 9 being announced this summer period so um i guess we're not going to see re9 this summer kind of was expecting it still kind of expecting it but the initial murmurs i heard i now do believe are right and re9's announcement is further away than this upcoming summer sorry for the back and forth on that that's my fault which i was saying earlier i feel like this is literally a tug of war at this point um resident evil 1 remake the uh rumored remake that we were supposed to get in the future rumors are now bs as far as i know re1 is not in any form of development at all right now resident evil 5 as we all speculated because we all thought that was going to be the next game as hinted in the ending of separate ways um is not actively in dev now either it's been funny seeing this uh, be what people think is happening publicly uh, resident evil 9 is pushed back too late 2025 to i guess early 2026 if everything i've heard is correct which i fully believe it is and i know others have hinted this and i'm not the first to say this publicly actually just it's not caught on there's actually a remake of resident evil zero and code veronica in development right now just just you know casually dropping two bombs out of nowhere so apparently we're getting a resident evil zero and a code veronica remake and they're apparently in development right now which is crazy um they're just wild uh and i know code veronica has been like the top uh, let me tell you that hot topic of like what games need to be remade in this franchise everyone says it's code veronica and i agree i feel like code veronica is that one game that needs it um resident evil 1 remake doesn't essentially need it but i want it code veronica desperately needs it and to be honest i feel like resident evil 0 needs it too um i didn't necessarily hate resident evil 0 i just thought some of the uh, creative choices they had in the game was kind of like a step down compared to um resident evil remake which is the 2002 version not to get you guys confused let's continue i've talked to many others behind the scenes about this at this point it's something i heard over a year ago i think it was going to get out whether i was the one to say it or not and that's about it so there you have it so apparently we have a remake of resident evil 0 and code veronica that are being in development right now which is wild to think about this guy just woke up and chose absolute violence for absolutely no reason he just straight up said that re1 remake is is complete bullshit don't believe that i'm gonna tell you the truth and that's zero and code veronica that are two games that are being in development right now which is i can't even wrap my head around this um i we kind of saw code veronica was gonna get like a remake eventually because of how many people want it but i don't think anyone necessarily asked for zero and if they did it was literally a huge minority that makes no sense huge minority there was a minority of people wanting it because how they felt about the original resident evil zero but i welcome it completely then somebody comments um wouldn't the zero and code veronica remakes be handled by m2 anyway so not to distract from re9 and resident evil 5 remake then he goes on to reply from what i've heard zero is primarily led by k2 and m2 who most recently did separate ways dlc for resident evil 4 and were a support studio on resident evil 4 I think M2 also did a Resident Evil 3 remake as well. Why 
Why is he hiding that? Code Veronica is Capcom Dev 1 with a lot of the same people who worked on Resident Evil 2 Remake and Resident Evil 4 Remake though. So guys, Code Veronica is apparently in good hands and I kind of knew that was going to happen anyway. Um, I feel like the only reason why Resident Evil Remake was cut out so much is because it was like a creative decision by Capcom. I think they are more incapable of doing a game just by judging separate ways itself. I think Zero is going to be a really good game too. Um, as long as the game does not get cut out in any means necessary then i'm i'm com i'm completely fine with that it's whatever it's zero even though i do believe rebecca should get another game besides zero um but this is fine too I, at least we're gonna get rebecca and billy back maybe we can see like the outcome of billy finally you know that man is still wandering in the forest uh, you know i don't know what they're gonna do with that but like i said about code veronica if it's being developed by dev one yeah if it's it's gonna be really good it's gonna be a really really good remake and i'm super excited for it but again um these are just rumors this isn't anything by capcom but he did say that RE1 re Remake is BS. Um, kind of a bummer, but I just personally don't know who the hell to believe anymore because this man is just dropping nukes left and right. Um, first, he told us that RE9 is close, then it isn't, then it is again. Now he's telling us it's in late 2025, early 2026 now. So I, I am just... I'm shot out. <laughs> I don't know what to think of him anymore. But let me know in the comments, guys. Um, do you believe this stuff? Do you believe that Resident Evil Zero is in development? Which kind of is an odd choice, to be honest. But I guess if you're going to remake one again, I guess you have to start from the beginning, which is Zero. Um, it only makes sense to do that. But why do Code Veronica for the second game being in development? On top of the 30th anniversary of Resident Evil 1 coming out. I don't know what Capcom is doing. I'm just here to give you guys the news. But let me know in the comments, do you want Resident Evil Zero Remake? I'm not even going to ask if you want a Code Veronica Remake, because we all know that's exactly what we want, including myself. Uh, but if you don't want a Code Veronica Remake, tell me in the comments why not. And guys, I have a second channel called Conjured Line 2. It's essentially just me doing the same thing what I do on this channel, but for a different channel and for more games outside of horror games, um, survival horror games. So I could just be playing, I don't know, like, X Defiant to like Elden Ring to like another game to this game. Um, I don't have a specific niche on that channel for now, but be sure to follow and support that channel. I'd highly appreciate you guys if you were to do that. Um, and also, and I have a Discord. Um, you guys can join. Everyone is welcome. Everyone is super nice. Um, we all talk about Resident Evil, obviously, and other games too. So be sure to join the Discord too. Everyone is completely welcome. But if you like the content, be sure to like the video. And if you're new to the channel, guys, welcome in and be sure to subscribe. And most importantly, guys, Make sure to be nice to someone you'll most likely make their whole week or their whole month. But as always, peace.